continues to take the world by storm. It seems like every day another industry is affected. Now a local dentist is putting it to the test by bringing in his very own robotic assistant. Ibrahim Samra has more from Smaller Smiles in Westland. It's the only dental robot in the area that performs on patients. So this basically will allow us to link the robot to the patient. And it sits right here next to Dr. Bruce Smoller. This is what is called a Yomi uh, link, an O-bite, which will allow us to have the robot follow all the movements along. So it's kind of like uh, Bluetoothing your phone to the radio? Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> it's precision. First in the area to have First it. in Michigan to have it. Efficiency. We actually can have things done within a matter of hours instead of months. An ability to store data. Hundreds of patients. Has made life easier for smaller. The Yomi dental robotic device, uh, the system is just a godsend for patients who want a procedure done more precisely, uh, quicker. So much so, he has performed on more than a thousand patients with it. They're blown away. They, they can't believe it. They're, they're used to getting their gums cut. They're used to getting their gums peeled back. They're, they're used to getting stitches. While the robotic assistant may be relatively new to some folks, it's been FDA approved since 2017. So why is Smoller the only one around using it? In, in every field from broadcasting to dentistry, there's something called stinking thinking. Not everybody knows what they don't know. So a lot of uh, people in dentistry are still doing procedures the same way from the 80s and 90s. It actually allows us to do things never before possible. And as I say, if it's good enough for my patients, it's good enough for me. In Westland, Ibrahim Samra, CBS News, Detroit.